Sucks Not. Danny, hi, soccer with Colin Inc. helping people do their business better. And today I'm gonna take you through a quick run through of the Jabra Direct software and the Jabra Evolve 275. I absolutely recommend that you download the software. It's absolutely free and it's gonna help you customize your experience with the Jabra Evolve 275 headset. So now if you're spending the money on a premium solution like this, you should absolutely make it optimized for you and make it perform optimally across all the UC platforms that you're utilizing it with. So now let's just jump into it. So let's take a look at the Jabra Link 380. I'm using the Link 380. It came with the one that I have is USB-A, but my PC is USB-C. So here you have the settings and you have the option to adjust the range from normal to low to very low. This is important if you are in a high density scenario, you can adjust the range to have more uh, of these Bluetooth headsets in one space or area. I, I don't think that's an issue right now during this pandemic, but it may become a thing. You also have the ability to enable remote call control between your Jabber device and the soft phone uh, through here. And you can disable it or enable it, but this is one of the things that sets a business grade headset apart from a consumer model. The ability to answer and end calls remotely through your little button on your headset is absolutely critical and the ability to mute uh, i recently wrote a blog where i did have that challenge with some of the consumer models that i was testing is the inability to mute a call via your headset you have to go to the actual mouse and do it so now let's go to the headset itself as you can see this is danny's jabber evolve 275 i'm going to show you where you can actually make that change uh, within uh, Jabber Direct. You can adjust the bass, the mid-range, and the treble, uh, and again, customize it for how you like to hear uh, sounds or music or streaming media. And here in your settings, you have a long list of options that you can adjust, uh, whether it's answering a call by rotating the boom arm, uh, boom arm mute, you know, flipping up the boom arm to mute it, boom arm guidance, you can have it either be a tone, voice, guidance or no guidance, basic peak stop and teletone, average daily audio exposure, Australian acoustic safety guidelines. You can put this thing auto sleep. Uh, you can set the time frame for that. Again, here's where you can rename your headset. So headset name, you can rename it here. This is an absolutely critical feature that I truly appreciate. So you have ANC, right? You have hear through sounds only uh, or hear throughs music and your surroundings, right? When you are focused on something and you have your ANC on and you might have music streaming through um, and your significant other just walk into the room, uh, instead of physically removing the headset, you can just uh, activate your uh, hear through. Auto resume audio motion detected. Uh, again, it's got sensors so you can use a headset motion sensor. It does have side tone. I get this question a lot uh, from our viewers, uh, whether or not headsets have side tone the Evolve 275 does. And so you have all these different uh, options available to you here. Uh, but you can see that it's all up to date. Uh, everything to include the software Jabber Direct is up to date. Uh, but anyway, that's just a quick run through of the Jabber Direct software and your Jabber Evolve 275. Uh, if you like this type of video, don't forget to like, subscribe, please comment below. Let us know what you'd like to see and we'll do our best to make it. Thanks.